if collision so if there is a collision between player one get wrecked and uh, oh player one get wrecked and uh, if finish address of finish then we write out that the player is win the game so I just copy this to here and instead of game over I write out that you win alright uh, let's try to compile it Huh? game.cpp oh parenthesis now we can compile it and run it that was quick it doesn't even start so I think the finished coordinate is don't changed in here so the current equal to free and I change the free in the map.cpp so in here I just change it to free compile and run okay it seems a little more promising so if I go and I finish that flag then probably it will give us the uvin text Okay, so nope, that is nothing happens. Why? Hmm. Why is nothing happening? I don't really know, but I write out the Finnish coordinates. So FTD count, and I just write out the Finnish X and the Finnish Y. Okay, uh, try it. Oh, I think I know what the problem is. Uh, the relative absolute coordinate, as always. So in here we don't have to check the finish. I make a new rectangle. Call it the rect, TMP rect. I hope it's not reserved already. And make it uh, and make it finish. Uh, finish dot x minus chord dot x and finish dot y and fifty fifty. That's it, and we have to check to for this. So TMP rect. And uh, now it should work now. It does. All right, and uh, mm, I think that's about it. You can do most. Uh, you can do more things, like in the original game, I did things like open, uh, so open a file game dot that and load the maps from there. And if there are more maps, then uh, load those. If I finish it and. Uh, so yeah, that's easy. So uh, 
most of the program is ready, although I am not quite satisfied with the result of this tutorial. I think I thought that it will be a quite easier tutorial and after I get into the explanations and things it turned out that it's quite hard actually it's a little more uh, difficult uh, tutorial than I originally planned there are a lot of confusing things like this absolute and relative coordinate I'm not sure that do you get it or not sometimes I don't even get it as you can see I in here even in the last thing I screw up because of those coordinates and uh, hmm, let me think so if you do not understand something then just uh, uh, comment or write a private message or something and I try to explain the part that do y uh, then that you don't understand okay uh, I think the game is a quite uh, good shell for a uh, more difficult or something a more better game it but it's actually just a shell it's uh, almost nothing more we have some basic animations and things like that so really not so great game it was actually just a practice an example program okay and I know myself that I make a lot of mistakes through the program and probably there are a lot of mistakes in it like I haven't deleted the player so delete player 1 okay because we reserved it uh, with new I have to delete it um, manually with delete okay and I forget the SDL in it which actually the third thing we should call whenever we initialize the SDL I don't know how is that possible that it's worked, but it's worked without it. Uh, yeah, so sorry about that. This, this should be an FDL tutorial, and I forget the first thing about the FDL. Hm? It happens. Okay, I just uh, I just saw it that there is no FDL in it in here. Uh, the original source would have these things but I don't copy that source code I just use sometimes when I don't know what should what should I do uh, so uh, yeah thank you for watching and have a great day